So to continue here, um, let's create the tail fin. Pretty much it's the exact same process as the previous video. What we do is we press Alt X so that it um, makes the uh, model invisible. And then what we want to do is we want to select our shapes, select the line, and we're going to draw a spline here for our tail fins. Select extrude. And what we want to do is move this down so that it is inside the aircraft. We can control X for this one as well. And apply an edit poly modifier. Select polygon mode, uh, element mode, and then select polygon mode and alt. And drag over here so we have just the bottom selected and hit delete so we delete the bottom there. Uh, and then you can go into your vertex mode and manipulate your vertexes. Actually it looks like we can move this back and move this forward. Now as you can see there's kind of like a little uh, bend here so we can actually select these and let's give this two segments and we're going to bring this um, actually what we'll do is we'll just give this one segment here We'll move this up to about 90. And then we'll create another segment here. And this is going to be right here where our, our bend is. We'll select vertex. And move it back. And move these forward. select edge and we want to select these edges here click on connect and what we want to do is we want to select two segments this time and we want to make this into a 90 pinch of a 90 and to get rid of this um, li extra line here, we don't really need this extra line. What we're going to do is, if you hold down control and you hit vertex, then it'll automatically select all the vertexes. And then you hit edge again. And what we want to do is we want to deselect this edge here. And we'll leave the remaining edge there. Hit remove. And then you click on vertex and all the vertexes are automatically selected. So you deselect all of the vertexes that you don't want to remove and then remove the remaining vertexes. So let's attach this now to the aircraft here. Actually, we can't attach it to the aircraft just yet because the aircraft has symmetry on there. We can copy Turbo Smooth. So Go back to your aircraft, click on Turbo Smooth and right click and select Copy. Then click on your tail fin and uh, let's collapse this. And then right click and uh, click Paste Instances. So next time when you click on Turbo Smooth, all of the Turbo Smooths uh, work at the same way. 
And so what we have is a very nice fin for our aircraft. The top of the fin could be actually done a little bit better. So let's work on that a little bit. So we can select these vertexes. Actually an easier way is just to go into here. Select the vertexes. And let's scale them together. There it is, that looks really nice. Now as you can see the nose of the aircraft has a little hole there. So let's fix that. Select vertex on your aircraft model. Let's go to the very uh, uh, very uh, tip of the nose here. And all you have to do is select collapse and then move these vertexes together. It's got some um, uh, kind of uh, interesting lines showing there, so let's fix that. We can move the vertexes outwards a little bit. and then we select our our edge mode and we just select all these vertexes here uh, select all these uh, lines there and click on connect and only do one segment and that's a little bit better